Hello guys, so let's discuss some terminology which is related to chemistry. First of all, what is atom? Atom is the smallest part of any matter. Atom give you a information about the arrangement of electrons and nucleus. Nucleus is made of protons and neutrons. Now what is element? Element is a species of atoms having the same number of protons in their atomic nucleus. So basically, a nucleus contains a number, the a particular number of protons. Now let's take an example of hydrogen. Hydrogen itself, it is a element. Now hydrogen have a one number of proton available in nucleus, and the helium, helium have a two number of the protons available in that nucleus. So this type of oxygen, neon, and we can easily call them by the atomic number by them the number of protons available that in nucleus so we can define them we can call them by their name so we can easily find them and, and one thing need to be remembered atoms is just a numerical value of that particular element now let's see briefly in another example first of all let's see what is molecule if two or more atom held together or say a joint together by chemical bond then it is known as a molecule like we have a one two example like h2o and o2 now let's see an example of h2o and now how many number of element it have we have in h2o there are only two element available one is hydrogen and then second is oxygen the number of the elements is available in periodic table so we you can easily find it from periodic table we can call that particular atom by their uh, element so this is just uh, the name given for the remain remembering them now h2o contains how many atoms like it contains two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen so it have a, only two elements available in h2o but number of three atoms available in h2o now let's see another example of o2 it contains only one element o oxygen and it contains two atoms of oxygen particular oxygen so atoms give you a number give you a numerical value of that particular element so two number of oxygen two atom of oxygen and but element is only one now let's see what is compound compound is a molecule that contains at least two different elements make sure it contains two different elements let's take an example of h2o how many elements available in this h2o first is hydrogen second is oxygen only two elements but we have three atoms like uh, we have a one of oxygen we have a first element of oxygen and two number of hydrogen so and let's take an example of o2 is it called as compound or it is called as molecule so first of all remember the definition of compound at least two different elements but we have only one element available in this oxygen dioxide o2 so it is not considered as a compound so o2 is not an example of a compound do remember that now let's see three another example and uh, we need to remember this line all compounds are molecules but not all molecules are compound so basically we can easily say that the all the uh, these all are the molecules because uh, ju just remember the re uh, definition of compound a compound is a molecule that contains at least two different elements but in molecule it is not necessary it may be a similar type of element or it may be a different type of element so every uh, combination of atoms is known as a molecule but it is not considered as a compound it need to be a different of both of them or two or more of them and now, um, now let's see oxygen is a compound or not it have a only one element of oxygen so it is not a compound but it is a molecule now ns3 it have a 
nitrogen and hydrogen two type of element so it is a compound now co2 it have a carbon and this have a oxygen two different type of element available in this formula so it is also a compound oxygen is not if we take a f2 then it is also not but like a ch3 it is uh, considered as a compound but do remember this line all compounds are molecules but not all molecules are compounds